See, when somebody can't experience the kind of a hurt that you have, then you don't expect them to say the nice things about you. You can imagine telling Apostle Williams now that you used to be a walker on the street. Because I have not experienced that. I'm going to see you as all the verbiage that's negative concerning a female. But when I have an experience, so the Bible said they looked for Jesus all over the place until finally they were directed to the temple. And the Bible said they were astonished that he was teaching in the temple. And they said, boy, he gave us a hand up. And he said, why? He said, did you not know? I wish I had some folks that would at least pray before they come to church. You mentioned it. He said, Did you not know that I would be about my father's business? And we got a whole lot of folk talking from behind the desk that they do in God's business when the church died. <laughs> if the church died and you ain't dead, you ain't doing God's business. Because if you, I wish I had some holy ghost people in the church. That's why we've got to allow folk to earn the right to have any part in your life. Don't tell me lift my hand. Lift your hand, I got a way for you. Put your hand in. Well. Well, this your season. Well, Joker, I, 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 I don't have enough for that. <laughs> Tell me something that's going to affect both me and you. Because what's this? The Bible says, faith comes by hearing. <laughs> and what I want to hear is how you was in something and God delivered you out. That's what's going to stimulate my faith. Tell me you're going to give me another car and get three in the garage now and then work it. <laughs> and we've got to allow folk to earn it. You remember? You remember back in the day when we used to be excited for God? You remember? We used to come to the church and we used to beat everybody there. We never used to worry about, about, about uh, 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 the ashes cleaning because we would come early enough to clean and leave late enough to tidy up. But because we can't no longer share in one another's experience. I promise we close some of this. I promise. What's this? God now is talking to Abraham. And he said to Abraham, he said, I'm going to keep my promise with you, Abraham. And I'm going to make your descendants as the sand of the sea. 